Now oh, this is pretty special. River Ribble. At Mitten. Good height. A bit bright, but don't worry about that. Good height. Probably can still run to be fair in that. Uh, but they will be slowing down, so you've got more of a chance now. So, all winter, been tired of a few flies, uh, mad for it really, so just a selection, probably stay to this side today, peaky colour, not too bright, that's more of a back end, so yellow and black, cascade, willy gun, park shrimp, that kind of thing, not too big, it's not massive, so I think we'll start with good old posh. Posh Tosh for your size 10. Cracking day. Feels like spring now. So I'll run through what I've got on. So, Posh Tosh, flamethrower style, black and yellow, classic. It's a probably three to four foot of 18 pound Maxima. Slow sinking tip, 10 foot. So uh, a shooting head. We've got a 13 foot fly rod, not too big. It's not massive here, might be bigger when you get down to uh, odder foot, but it's not too big, it's manageable. So, we'll have a run down here, see what's about. Well, the fish down there, all the way, 
It's a bit slower down here, down towards that dead tree. I've had two trout, <laughs> which obviously got the app pumping. That's in that fast water up there. So, decent start, at least we've had some fish. I've changed my fly to more of a cascady flamethrower. I'd like to say I've changed it because it's not much colour in the water, but what actually happened is uh, I caught it in the trees up there. So, nice fly in them trees if anybody wants to get it. Bloody thing. I've never fished it in the summer for trout. Uh, I believe it's a fiver a day. And it's, to be fair, it's unbelievable trout water. Loads of pocket water, loads of glides, short glides for trout. Yeah, like, look at this for trout. Probably hold some big trout, to be fair. Uh, it's run through the Ribble Passport scheme. So it's £15 a day for uh, salmon and five a day for trout and then course fishing. I think they might be odd chubby here. I don't know if Bar will get this far. But it's a hell of a fishery. Worth £15 of anyone's money. That's what I will say. Look at that. I'm going to go in there, I think.
recall. No, I've seen a fish, heard a fish. There were three trout, a couple of other knocks, but they're all trout. Um, it's lower than what I'd probably like, so I have been, I have been gentle with my approach. You know, I'm casting a long line, but then once it's hit the water, I'm fishing square, fishing fast, downstream men, stripping it back, uh, working the rod, just trying all different things. I think, I think there's certain conditions to fish slow, especially when it's high, but when it's like this, and the springers don't forget, so they're aggressive. So I won't be too gentle with your approach. You know, I'll be stripping it back, making it move, making that fly come alive so they're aggressive, they'll wallop it. If it was high, fair enough, you know, I'll be slowing it down and fishing it on the dangle and stuff like that, but the water's cold, but I think if they saw it, they'd, they'd, they'd definitely hammer it. Like, it only takes one fish for it to be a good day, especially spring fishing. Uh, you know, if I had one fish here, I think if you covered it, I think you'd take it. I think it'd definitely take it. Um, we'll keep plodding on down here. Still plenty of river to go at. I've seen my first swallow at years, so things are looking up now. You know, it's spring when they've arrived, I'd like to see swallows. It's the earliest I've ever seen one, this. Here we see them about 12th, 13th of April. What's today? 3rd? 2nd? 3rd? 3rd, I think. So that's really early. So, does that mean we're going to have a good spring? So, we'll go a bit further, eh? I hope you can see him. Yeah, there he is. First swallowers of the year. You're looking up now, lads. Sad mine. Look at that. Anymore? Oh, there's another. This is a one off. A few about. As far as I know, this is Kelp's pool. Runs all the way down to there. And then on that far grass bank, that's called a foot there. So if any fish have pushed up, you'd bet your uh, you'd bet your house there'd be one in there. But I've heard this is a lovely even pace through really, here. Yeah. Big boulders. Deep. That's middle river on the other side, we up road all the way down. Right down there. Middle river go a fair way, I think. A lot of money though for what it is. Nice water here though. You'll have a do here. So we changed tactics. Gone for heavier sink tip and a monkey. <clears throat> Black and chartreuse monkey. It's a lot clearer, even in the deep bits, it's a lot clearer than the fort. So you know, your, your willy guns and that. Willy guns and a cascade. I just thought it were a bit a bit too bright. A uh, black wing. With a bit of yellow, chartreuse. A bit of flash. It just seems to be blending in that bit more. I like that. I like that a lot in my salmon flies. I like it to blend in. It's getting a getting cloudier now hopefully after tea once it, the sun comes off at water I think that might be our best chance if I'm honest um, but yeah we'll just try something different I think there's a fish here I do <laughs> definitely in this beat just down there you know like down down this run here where those sheep are it's got to be some fish knocking about it's got to be so we'll keep plugging away See what happens. We only need one, don't we? It's all we're after. You know, asking a much. Fourteen pound sea lice, fresh as a daisy. You know, not much really. That'll do. Yeah. 
Shall we go down here? Well, no to report. Not seeing a fish. A lad trout fishing down at Calderfoot said he saw some jump out, but he said he could have been a trout. But, uh, I don't know. Still really bright. See behind me, not a cloudy sky. Uh, I've had a lot of trout though. So that, uh, this is a bit blank. Been a few fish rising. So it's better for trout game. So, I'll have one must uh, go through here till probably dark. And then uh, that'll probably be it. So if you don't hear up from me, obviously you can caught a fish. So hope you've enjoyed this video. If you'd like and subscribe to my channel, I'd much appreciate it. See you on the next one.